Nick Wambua, who now joins us live from Mavoko for an update. Uh, Nick, there seems to be two things running parallel. One, On one hand, uh, a governor is being sworn in, and on another, one of the contenders says it's just not over yet. Yes, Akisa, that is the situation uh, here in Machakos County. Currently, I'm in Mavoko constituency, uh, considering that uh, this is a uh, Wavinia and it is stronghold. Uh, that is uh, purported to be a uh, Wavinia and it is stronghold in Machakos County. Uh, this county number 016 uh, Akisa. And uh, just in the concluded general election, it was a uh, highly contested ones, uh, one uh, for that matter. And uh, in this case, when Mutua is being sworn in today, uh, Wavinia and it is also alleging that. Um, She'll be moving to court, uh, that is with her, uh, her deputy governor, uh, Peter Maduki. They'll be heading to the court uh, just to contest uh, this uh, particular election, saying that they are confident in the courts that they are going to make it and that the government, the next government in Machakos County is going to be theirs. And uh, Akisa currently, uh, right now, want to speak uh, to the uh, uh, Wavinia Andeti, who has just issued a statement some minutes ago uh, on this particular matter, uh, just to listen at uh, what they are basing their argument on uh, in this particular case. That are going to be presenting in court. Uh, welcome uh, to Kate News, uh, Madam Governor. Thank you. And for that matter, you just mentioned that you're going to be, you'll be moving to court to uh, contest uh, this, uh, this election in Machakos uh, uh, County. Uh, basically, what are you looking at? How was the election? Was it fair to you? Because uh, what are you basing uh, your court uh, argument on? You see, it is very clear, even to the people of Machakos, that their victory was stolen from them. This is not about Wavinia. It's about the people of Machakos. We know what happened. We have the facts. You've seen, I've not spoken. I've not spoken since the elections. Yeah? I was busy counter-checking what the people are telling me, whether it was true or not. And we have come out with facts. There was a lot of uh, uh, stealing in, in Machakos County. You know, you cannot... Um, I've, I've even had my opponent saying that uh, Wavinia should come, we work together. I don't know the people who are planning demonstrations. What? Let me tell you. You ask yourself, why would pe people plan demonstration? You're talking on demonstration. You're not talking about the thiefery, the, th the, the stealing that has happened. In Machakos, there was a lot of stealing from the polling stations. Yeah? We have facts how county resources were used yeah? during the elections and even during the polling day. We have all those facts, yeah? And uh, we know the people of Machakos. Even if you go and speak to them, they voted, yeah? They gave us their votes almost in totality, yeah? And they're not happy about what happened. So for me, I, I don't want to get into details about the case, but I want to assure you the case is very strong, and that is why this guy has panicked. He has panicked. He has gone to be the first one to be sworn. And I can and in if he knows he's a... Uh, if he knows he is okay. Yeah? Nikule could try to reassert. Yeah? Ameiba, and I can be a raka, kusema sasa, ni mengia na ni mimi. Ata kikalia yokiti kama siyo yake. The cause will make a decision. Ata kalia leo, kesho koti tamutoa. So for me, um, sioni chakunini, na nambio tu amachako zuakue na amani. Let them be peaceful. As we don't want to fight with anybody, we are going to follow the law. Wali nipeleka kotini. Nikaenda marakaribu sijui nane, kotini, nikirudi hapo kila siku, na tukashinda. Na niko na imani, hata hii tukienda kotini, tutashinda. We are going to win. So for him, let him not start panicking and uh, stop mentioning wavinya, 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 or mentioning my family. I cannot have children, you understand, without knowing how I'm going to take care of them. <laughs> uh, Akisa, that is uh, the governor candidate in Machakos County. And I'm just going to speak to the deputy here, uh, that is uh, uh, Peter Maduki. Uh, Peter, uh, what do you think about the elections? Uh, as you're alleging, they were not fair in Machakos County, yes. But uh, then, what, 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 what evidence do you have in court, uh, to take in court, uh, that uh, in this election it is not fair? I can only say that, uh, indeed, this was a tyranny of ballot theft. That's what I can say in Machakos. It's very clear. Very confident that, of course, the people of Machakos will come out strong. We won this. We have a very strong legal team that is in place collecting evidence and they're putting together in this. We may not need to go into the details or merits of the case as it were now, because the legal team is putting that together. But I can assure, I can tell you, as they get sworn in today, I can tell you majority of the people in my chakos are not happy with that whatsoever. And that is why it will not be, that's why it's taken time 
possible to ferry people from Kitui, from Makuwena, from everywhere, not from Machakos. And therefore, we are confident people are with us, are on our side. And therefore, we will still go to court to seek for justice because, of course, that is what belongs to them. Yes. So, and when are you planning to make this move, to go to court? Uh, the legal team is in place for any time from now because the legal team is in uh, putting the evidence uh, together to, bring, to make sure it is tight. And I can tell you for free, mm. it is tight. Yes. And therefore, this uh, seat doesn't belong to those who are being sworn in today. It, I can tell you this for free. It belongs to the people standing right in front of you and the people of Machakos. Thank you very much. So, Akisa, that is it. That is it. the governor candidate in Machakos County and the deputy of Vinyandeti here and Peter Maduki. So they are confident that after, after moving to the court, then they are going to get justice. And they're believing that the next government in Machakos County is, uh, it belongs to them. That is what they believe. But then only time will tell. That is after they present their case in court uh, just after Mutu has been sworn in. So we are waiting to see as the events unfold here in Machakos County. And then we'll be telling you what comes next. Back to the studio. Nick Wambo, our reporter there, joining us live from Mavoko. We continue to follow up on the politics of Machakos County. Wavinian Dati and her deputy there saying they will be moving to court, but that's just uh, minutes after Alfred Mutua has been sworn in as uh, the governor for Machakos uh, County for a second term. Now, emotions reign high at the Requiem Mass.